Yo, yeah, what's up, guys? So, we got a package from Edwin Padilla. It's He's actually letting me borrow something to stream for you guys. But the coolest part about it all, I opened the top of the box and I almost forgot. He gave me an early Father's Day present. So, let's get into the video right now. Hey, everybody. It's your girl, JLove81, and you're watching my boy, T-Belly. What's up, YouTube? What's up, YouTube? It's me, your guy, T Bizzle, T Belly, Rockstar. <laughs> What's up, guys? With a brand new video. Disclaimer. You're probably going to see two or three videos after this that were recorded months before this. But we got to get to this one right now. Because it's brand new live shit. Okay, guys. So, we got a package from Edwin Padilla. He basically, he's lending me his Dreamcast so I can stream it to convince me that this Dreamcast is good. <sighs> good luck, my boy. Good luck convincing me. I have a long history with the Dreamcast. And I'll talk about that after we check out the goodies he let me borrow. So, first off, here's a note from Edwin. Uh, Quesadilla Padilla, his new name, Quesadilla Padilla, sorry. Dear T-Belly, I hope all is well with you and your, and your loved ones in these crazy times. Inside this box is my Dreamcast, along with an early Father's Day present. I want to give a big salute to you and your amazing gaming skills. If you do, if you do decide to go full-time, I will be here to support you on your new endeavor. I'll be watching the bosses hit the dirt. Edwin Padilla, P.S. Stiff arm the baby. Let me tell you guys something. Stiff arm the baby changed my life. Maybe that's why I'm single. Um, well, I'm, I'm, I'm dating somebody if that makes sense. Talking to somebody, seeing somebody if that makes sense. One person, but you know, not like last summer. I had four women last summer, but I'm like, nah, I gotta stop. Gotta stop. But stiff arm the baby, guys. That stiff arm the baby. If you wanna hear stiff arm the baby, watch my Ghosts and Goblins um highlights. On um on Twitch and uh, video coming soon for that. I gotta do the stream. I haven't done it at the time of this recording. But anyway, boom. Let's get to the point. Okay, so I don't know if I should just pull things out like this. I already see something there. Okay, so we got we got a little bit of um we got some bubble wrap. J Love, I don't want to pop them because I gotta send it back. But J Love, this is for you, my girl. You already know. Okay, so we got the AV cable. Which is a beautiful AV cable. I might actually buy the, um, what's this cable called? The uh, cable that connects to like a PC. I forgot the name of that shit. But I might buy that because my, my TV has that. We have the AC adapter right here. So this right here is my... Oh my God! Yo, my boy, why you did this? I know this is my gift. This has nothing to do with Dreamcast. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, my boy. Wow. Wow. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's the cover of Battletoads. The original Battletoads. The best Battletoads that I've played so far. Oh my god, yo, man, this is like a, um, I forgot what you call these, but it's like a cloth so you can hang it. I gotta get this on my wall. I gotta get this on my wall. I really gotta get this. And it, oh my god, this is actually like a flag. It's actually a flag. It's a Battletoads flag. Yo, we gotta get this on my wall. Holy shit, yo. Edwin, bro. Guys, I'm gonna I'm put a picture right now. So you can see the whole thing in its glory. See how big it is on a king size bed. This is a king size bed. Holy shit. Yo, why you did that shit, bro? What the fuck is this? What's this? Oh, you let me borrow this too? No way. You didn't just give me this, bro. Are you kidding me? Go to page 9 and select SD card for the full Genesis library and hit start to play a game 
No fucking way, bro. You didn't just do this, bro. No way, Edwin. Why would you do this? Yo, what the fuck? I gotta confirm that this is a gift for me, but it has to be. Why would he send this? Yo, bro. Oh, my God. Yo. I. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hold up. Hold up. Let's start this over. Hold up. Okay, I'm back, guys. I know the video is going to go long, but yo, he he gave me a Sega Genesis portable player. Portable gameplay, bro. I'm bringing this to work tonight. We're going to beat Bloodlines. Yeah, I'm going to cheat and beat Bloodlines at work. <laughs> Don't worry. T. Belmont will take care of business, but holy shit, bro. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. That's, that's all I'm going to say is wow. Yo, my boy, thank you so much. Um... Shit, I don't know how to I don't know how to repay you with this. I don't know. I'm gonna hit you up just to make sure this is a gift for me, but I'm pretty sure it is. I'm pretty sure this is a gift for me. If it's not, I'll put it right there. But if there's nothing pops up, this is a gift for me and wow. You know, I always complain about the PSP. I have a PSP Go modded and it just It just doesn't work good. This D-pad is excellent, man. This is this is this is the business right here. You know, the, the six button layout is a little awkward, but for the games I'm going to be playing, plus, you know, it's just, a, you know, to, for me, these things are more for like just trying out games, practicing before I really play them. So, yo, thank you so much, my boy. Thank you, man. Holy shit. Now let's get to the Dreamcast games that we're going to be playing. We're going to be testing out all these games. I've actually played this before. We got Sega Bass Fishing. We got Sega Marine Fishing. Fucking fly. It is officially summertime. I had a fly just attack me. Sonic Adventure. Shenmue. Wow. We got Shenmue right here. I actually have it on the PS4, but I'll play that one. NFL Blitz 2001. Marvel vs. Capcom. NHL 2K. Mortal Kombat Gold. This is a great game. I used to have this game. Virtual Tennis, very good game. I used to have this game too. Yo, Edwin, you 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 sent you sent some good ones. Let me place this safely on the bed. We have NFL 2K. NFL 2K1. NFL 2K2. NBA 2K NBA 2K1 NBA 2K2 World Series Baseball 2K1 and because they didn't come out in 2K they came out 2K1 and then World Series Baseball 2K2 which is by the way these 2K2 games these are late Dreamcast games late in the lifespan so those are those are special games to have they're probably gonna be the best of the best, but I'm gonna play all of them in order, like to to show to show how good they are. Now the NFL 2K games, these games, these games age pretty well from what I remember. But we're gonna check it out. We're definitely gonna check it out. So what good is a Sega Bass fishing game without the actual fishing rod? Without the actual fishing rod. So my sister had one of these, believe it or not. She uh, got him off a crackhead, got a, a whole Dreamcast and lot for 20 bucks. Not that many games. And it came with this uh, with this fishing rod thing for the Dreamcast. It's really cool. Really cool item. Um, you know, I don't want to open this up right now because I don't want to mess up the bubble wrap. But yeah, this is a fucking cool item right here. So we're going to be fishing on stream. We're going to be fucking fishing, dudes. Oh, man, that's dope. Right here we have the Sega Dreamcast controller. I mean, I already started, right? Right here, we got the Sega Dreamcast controller with some goodies attached to it. So, let's just finish opening this up. And I'm going to show you guys the rest of the package. There's only one more thing to go, so. Now, this controller, I see a lot of people kind of diss it. I always thought this was actually a very good controller. 
And the uh, Xbox. Xbox has got their design cues from this controller. This is pretty much where Xbox went. So for Xbox having like pretty much one of the best controllers out there, I think the best controller design out there, I mean, it started with this. So right now we have a Sega Dreamcast controller with a VMGU and it looks like we also have a rumble pack. Yes, we do. We have a rumble pack on it. This is a very, I, I, th I like the controller. A lot, a lot of people give it slack for not, for having, they forget. It's two memory units. You got the visual memory unit as well as a rumble pack. You know what I'm saying? You had triggers, some of the first triggers. Not the first, but some of the first. And they're pretty good. You got um, XYBA, nice, nice joypad. The D-pad's a little loose, but I like the D-pad. It's a very solid control. A lot of people give it slack. I think one of the coolest features, not only is the VMU that's in the front, but being that it has two slots. N64, you can only put a memory card or a rumble pack. With this, you can put the VMU, I think that's what it's called, and the rumble pack. So. A lot of people forget about that with Dreamcast, you know what I'm saying? And then last but not least, now this is one thing I would say. There's no, no, no matter how much you dislike the Dreamcast, the design of the Dreamcast, the design. All right guys, so what we have here is the Sega Dreamcast. This was Sega's last console, but I tell you what, the design on this is beautiful. Beautifully designed console. I had to actually make the jump cut to this one because this was well worth it. You got four controller slots, power, open button. If you've never seen the Dreamcast, it actually was powered on. Has a very, very satisfying power button. The reset, the eject button to open it up nice and sleek. You know, disk drive. Then in the back, you have the AV out as well as the AC port. And right here, the network adapter, guys. Very first console to launch with online capabilities was this one. Even though it's 56K modem, they did have a DSL upgrade that you could have gotten in the past. But this is a very beautiful console. If there's one thing the Dreamcast is, it's a beautiful console. And that, my friends, is real. That is the honest truth. It's a beautiful console. So, yeah, guys, the Sega Dreamcast. I'm just borrowing it. I'm going to be playing it on stream. Um... I don't think those games are, are gonna convince me, man. I don't think so. Now, to say that the system totally sucks, no. But the thing is, like with me, I prefer better versions of games. So when I have my Dreamcast, I play GTA 2 on the Dreamcast. You know, just as an example of like games that were on PlayStation 1 and N64, I wanted them on Dreamcast. Like Mortal Kombat Go, that's like a deluxe Mortal Kombat 4, NFL Blitz. You know what I'm saying? NBA Showtime. Um, yeah, he doesn't have that one, but NBA Showtime, like, obviously they look better on the Dreamcast. You know, and it's just, it was a really dope system for its time. Really dope. And my my hatred towards the Dreamcast comes with the fact that there was a store called Funko Land, which was like before GameStop, and I traded the house to get this. And for the system to die in two years, I'm like, man, I, I gave away a legacy of games you know, TurboGrafx-16, Sega CD, Genesis, NES, just to name a few, a PS1, a, a whole great long generation of games for a two-year generation console, and it always made me have a bad taste in my mouth. But we're going to let bygones be bygones. We're going to give this bad boy a test on stream in the near future. We're going to be playing it for like a month, maybe even more. And I'll be very honest, what, the, the, will it convince me to actually get one myself? We shall see. But thank you, Edwin. Thank you, Quesadilla Padilla, for hooking me up, trusting me to borrow that. I mean, we cool. We email each other. I got to give you my number, man. But um, thank you so much, man, for let giving me that. And thank you so much for that gift, that Battletoads flag. Oh, my God. I'm still like, my heart's actually pumping a little bit. And I'm saying my heart doesn't pump for video games, but it's pumping for Battletoads. I love me some Battletoads. I, I love it. Like... Look right here, Battle Tools. I got my original copy that I beat right there. I got my T Zits on display. This was from Zombie JLT1. My boy Zombie hooked this up. Shout out to the Mexican Legion of Doom. And um, yeah, man, I, I I couldn't be more thankful for this. Sorry if there's noise. This is why I don't record in the day, but I had to do this live because I forgot he gave me a gift. And wow, wow, what a gift. Thank you so much. So, guys, if you're a Dreamcast lover, Get ready for some streams in the near future, like maybe in the next two weeks. 
But that's it for today, guys. It's me, your guy, T-Belly. And I'm signing off, y'all. Cheers.